explain that witches or villains uh, in movie industry in general are becoming more sexy more oh, attractive. Pardon. Comment est-ce que vous pouvez expliquer le fait que dans au cinéma de les méchants deviennent de plus en plus on les accepte et deviennent vraiment les héroïnes de, des films um, Well, she's not, I don't know if I'm the heroine of the film, but she si does, I'm a lot of sin herself, and from the original was always, en fait, dans, de, de, I think, quite elegant, and she, she was sexy in a way, in a, in a, in a strange way, she's sexy. Um, Elle est sexy. No. Not as acceptable, like, but not as acceptable. No, I don't know, I mean, I think that's an interesting question for, for Rome. For women and roles for women and women in power, being able to show all sides of de pouvoir aussi of what it is to be a woman and that uh, you know, I think de, de, de sometimes that femme, you know, in, in, a, in, a, in a very superficial way to be able to show this kind of dark or wicked side, but I think for a character like Maleficent, un, un rôle comme Maleficent she has many different facets elle a of her that explain de facettes, uh, en elle qui explique ce qu'est um, la femme. And I think it's I think it's nice. I don't think there's. Um, I, I suppose it is new. It doesn't feel new to me. But I suppose it is. Il n'y a rien de nouveau. Il n'y a rien de nouveau à tout cela. Question. Hello, I'm Evelyn from Belgium. I sorry, Elle. I have another question for Angelina. J'ai aussi une autre question pour Angelina. Exactly. De toute façon, c'est moi qui ai vous aussi, il y a un autre film dans lequel votre fille joue la jeune Aurora. Comment ça a été de jouer avec votre fille et comment est-ce qu'elle l'a fait Elle était très excitée. Elle te cherche en fait. It, well, it came naturally because um, we didn't want her to be in a film. We don't want to no, push our children to be actors, but uh, uh, there were a few little kids that came to set, and every time they saw me, they'd scream. And one little boy said, Mommy, tell me which to stop talking to. <laughs> so, <laughs> they, uh, they really were, I couldn't, so we couldn't really cast somebody who would uh, be loving towards a monster. Um, so, but Vivian is that, uh, that little girl that kind of clings to her mom no matter what I'm doing and, and so uh, she she was unfazed by me being very mean and even my character says to her I don't like children and she just smiles and thinks it's great um, so who, who, who else could have done that um, she was great she was really it was really funny but it's it's hard work you know kids like all kids you don't They don't want to be taught, told what to do. They like the idea of being a princess and they like working with mommy, but when they have to do it more than once and hit their mark and, you know, whatever it may be, they, uh, so it was a little bit of work. So daddy and I were there that day kind of being coaches and, and uh, it, was, it, was hard, it was hard work. Question? Oui, parmi les quelques phrases qu'on a entendues dans les extraits qu'on a vus ce matin, il y a celle-là que vous prononcez, « Le mal existe, la haine et la vengeance ». Est-ce que c'est une constatation de ce type qui vous engageait à faire ce film et peut-être même à faire les films que vous faites Well, there's a, there's a saying in the next one we saw that says, well, basically, evil exists, hatred exists, vengeance exists. Is it one of the reasons why you were also attracted to some of the subterranean themes of Maleficent? And is it also why, I mean, in general, you fight the fights you do? Oh, well, that's a heavier question. Yes. I think, I mean, sadly, there is, of course, real evil in the world. Il y a vraiment and, uh, you know, du mal dans le monde, et vous regardez les informations, et vous voyez tous ces gens and, uh, qui so souffrent, et tellement de and cruauté. Like et c'est vraiment des choses inimaginables, comme ces jeunes filles qui ont été kidnappées au Nigeria. Um, c'est vraiment des choses, une cruauté so inimaginable. I, uh, 
Ce film n'était pas là pour ça, il n'explorait pas Je pense qu'il y a là, pour nous tous, il y a beaucoup de choses très profondes pour nous de comprendre pourquoi tout cela existe. Et pour faire un film comme celui-là, ça fait partie aussi du plaisir, parce que c'est Disney, il y a toujours un bon message, il y a toujours un aspect bon et positif. Et Now nos enfants doivent déjà so affronter tellement de choses dans notre monde, il y a tellement de douleurs really dans le monde et de, et, et, et de mal. Question uh, Hi, uh, c'est bon aussi. Disney Channel Friends. Uh, the question is to both of you. What was the most exciting la question est pour vous deux, quelle a été la scène la plus excitante uh, sur Maléfique yeah, so à faire the most yeah. I think... For me, I was really moi, looking forward to je, the spindle scene, la, la, just because when I when I um, when I look at the film, like the Parce animated film, that film, that part, Maleficent didn't scare me as much as the part when Aurora switched out of her Aurora girly qui, self qui and like went into that trance, and then et, you see kind of the green and the purple colors of like Maleficent and like the, the lighting changes. So I was, I, I, I was very like, I wanted to be really specific Je about that, très, très that one moment, and like so you get to see when Maleficent and that the curse vous a, vous voir takes over her body and, and she is just leading her to find a spindle. And so that we did that scene, it was like, it was my last day of filming um, for me on set moi, and yeah, it was very exciting when we had the green lights but it was also really tough because the spindle was so um, thin it was, and it was so tiny and they had lights underneath the spindle so you and I and my eyes because I had to, I wasn't I wasn't blinking so I had to look at the spindle but sometimes you go cross-eyed because of that and so yeah so sometimes I would I thought that I would I thought like oh je, so perfect, my fingers je, je like me, going right down on the spindle, and no, I would vraiment, never, I, I wouldn't hit it. I just go like non, straight past it, and we'd have to keep doing it again and again. So there was definitely a challenge. As well, yeah. Somebody please pull those Yeah, my eyes are like this, and vraiment je louche. You did a great stunt fall. Non, non, mais vous avez fait une très bonne chute. Yeah, slow motion. Yeah. What about the scene that was maybe the most challenging for you? The most challenging was the christening. Pour moi, ça a été vraiment because le baptême. I, because it had been done before perfectly. It's that moment. Et c'est vraiment ce moment. C'est le moment. J'ai été vraiment très effrayée. Mais je me suis dit, allez, il faut y aller avec autant de plaisir que possible. En tout cas, c'est la question que vous donnez, 